offense to the majesty of the eternal fire. Let's go kill some monsters! That's a place of culture, not... This where Madame Marina's trip performs? Yeah, but you can only enter with a ticket. There's no performance now. Mamas are just rehearsing. Process is interesting to observe, though. So, want a ticket? No performance. Said so yourself. You can still get a ticket. What'll it be? Need a ticket? Yeah, one. Here. Just stay out of sight, eh? Awful bashful, these mamas in rehearsal. Almost. Almost equal. Holy moly, no. you're a scare. What was wrong with that? Madam Marina, can we talk? Geralt of Rivia. Dandelions told us so much about you. Is he with you? No, but I hope to bring him back soon. Here to talk about Dudu. Hmm. Let's speak in my quarters at the back of the theater. We'll be undisturbed there. How can I help? We've not seen Dandelion or Dudu recently. Dandelion's in trouble. That much I guessed. Though I am curious how serious it is. Did he seduce a powerful man's wife and go into hiding? Or did he write an offensive couplet about the priests of the Eternal Fire? Worse. Lots. I'm gonna try to help him. Gotta contact Dudu first. But he's disappeared as well. I have a plan to lure him out of hiding, but I need your help. Can I count on you? Naturally, but what can we possibly do? I want to stage a play. Something that'll really draw the crowds. I see. And you hope it'll get Dudu's attention as well, draw him here. So it must be an entirely new play, and who will write it? Priscilla, actually. She's done writing it. Tells the story of a witcher who rescues a Doppler from certain death. Mm. Sounds interesting. I'll gladly have a glance. But first we must think about getting the word out and organizing some protection. Ushers. Would you mind tending to these matters? How can I help you spread the word about the premiere? Well, we'd like all the city to hear about it, so we must clearly talk to the Puffins. Who are the Puffins? Street artists. Get them to announce the premiere, and even the muscles on the harbor piling will hear about it. Where'll I find them? They did occupy some rooms in the bits in a townhouse, but I can't be sure they're still there. I've not seen them in the streets lately. They may very well have hung up their body hose. 
I'll see if I can find them, and if they'll work for us. Think we need ushers? A play about Dopplers could be controversial, but are ushers absolutely necessary? Can't be sure if you've attended many performances, but Novigrad crowds can be particularly difficult. Rotten apples, tomatoes, eggs, that sort of thing? Axes, butcher's knives, and bricks, actually. All right, know anyone appropriate? Try the docks, perhaps. You're bound to find some men willing to do any work for a few crowns. Thanks for helping. I'll come back once I've found some ushers. See you then. How can I be of service? Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. A better rate you'll not find anywhere in the city. How can I be of service? I need coin. Guess I have to take out a loan? Of course. I'll arrange it right away. Just like that? Lady Yennefer of Bengerberg long ago declared herself your guarantor, were these circumstances ever to arise. Besides, we tried and true methods for collecting debts. My, what a freak. How can I be of service? How's business? Really? That's the best you've got. That's like asking a fisherman if they're biting, or an old gran about her health. Business is booming. There's profit to be made from war, provided you've the know-how. Before Nilfgaard had even crossed the Pontar, I'd contracted for insured deliveries of wood and iron from Kovia. Reaped a sevenfold return on my investment. Nice. So you might think, but then there's the non-human poll tax, the church's tithe, war taxes, and my overhead. Subtract all that and you're left with a pittance. A dozen or so chests, and no more. Till next time. Hmm. How to find Novigrad? Top-notch swords! Show me what you have in stock.
so long. Nice tune. Damn sad, though. Then it successfully conveys my mood. What do you seek here? Looking for the puffins. Have I found them? We've no coin. Leave us be! Think there's been a mistake. Sorry. Thought our landlord had hired another thug to collect from us. Don't want any coin from you. In fact, I'm willing to pay you, provided you agree to get the word out about Madame Arena's new play. Oh, afraid that's impossible. Ever since we premiered our fateful ballad about Holy Hemelfart, who his faith ignores, gorges himself, diddles old whores, Fatso's gang has been harassing us incessantly. Fatso's gang? Common thugs and the church's pay. City's full of gangs like that now. They threaten me, sir. Said they round off her pointy ears with a carving knife. They don't let us perform. Chase away spectators, destroy our instruments. Maybe they've taken to lurking outside our home. We're at wit's end, no clue what to do. All right. Say I get Fatso and his boys to leave you alone. Will you publicize Arena's play then? Of course. But you shan't find it easy. There's no talking to that lot. I'm not a great talker anyway. Witcher! Witch hunters have all day you say it again! again. <laughs> so you're the ones. Oh, I fat so. Look what we got here. Is it just me or you got cat eyes? Right, he does. Stray cat must have fucked his mum. <laughs> Now, what you doing in the city of eternal fire, cat shit? Leave the puffins alone. Worms that insulted Iraq Emelfart? Called him an allmonger? I'd sooner snuff out the holy flame itself. Tell them fucking poets to come down here. Shove their fruits up their blaspheming assholes. Yeah, to play a different tune then, every time they fought. <laughs> Get out of here. Now. What? Fuck yeah. Ah, what a sight. You really showed them. One, two over the back, then pow, right in the noggin. I'll finally be able to leave my home without hiding beneath a hood. Thank you. Very much. Come on, it was nothing. Oh, it was something, right? I don't dare think we've forgotten our promise. 
We'll strip our voices ragged praising Arena's new play. How much will I owe you? Not a copper. Helped us out. See no reason why we shouldn't help you. Get half of town to come to the play. Wait and see. Some quick preparations and we'll be out in the streets. <laughs> Till the next. Good fight. Some nice footwork there. Challenging me, or is it hell you want to face? A Witcher versus the Beast of Metina. Killer Instinct versus Primal Rage. I'd like to hire you to help out. We're staging a play. Need us to kick some ass on stage. Actually want you to usher. Keep the peace. Make sure no one's ass gets kicked, on stage or off. Got the wrong men. Ass kicking's what we do. I pay well. Stand to make more than you do here. Expecting trouble? Well, we need to bust some heads. Can't rule it out. Bricks could start flying. Heard that from a reliable source. Now! Wanna smash some bricklayers? Oh, he does, he does! Oh, I don't know my own brother. Give me that coin. And don't fret. We'll be there before any of the uh, dancing starts. Ah, 
there you are. Managed to hire some ushers. Wonderful. That's one matter resolved. Wanted to talk about the text itself. Hmm. It's not at all badly written. In fact, I quite like it. I was willing to relax my standards to help Dudu, but we may have something very interesting here. I have very clear ideas who to cast as the servant, the witcher, and the queen, but I'm not certain who should play the prince and the princess. Who is playing the witcher? An amateur. It'll be my first time working with him, but I'm confident he'll pull it off. Newcomer to the troupe? In a sense. Oh, stop pretending you don't know. I'm talking about you. It's a good idea. Doubt I'll get a standing ovation, but Dudu will see me. That's the key. But you will make an effort, won't you? Learn your lines, at least. I'll give it a shot, of course. So, about the princess. Small part, but an important one. Any idea who could play her? Priscilla would be the obvious choice. She's young and beautiful. Yet, I do have more stage experience. Let's have Priscilla do it. No offense, but uh, most people... Assign greater importance to appearance than to talent. I understand. I shall let her know. I'm certain she'll be wonderful. So who do you see playing the Doppler Prince? I'm finding it hard to decide between two candidates. Abelard Ritzer would be the safe bet. He's been part of our troupe for ages, has flawless technique, but he doesn't exactly captivate the crowds. Who's your other option? Maxim Bollier, outstanding actor, and audiences love him, but sadly I can never be sure he'll show up sober, or that he'll show up at all. Let's risk it and give the role to Maxim. He's had a good spell of late, so maybe he won't let us down. All right. Got the cast figured out. It seems so. Prepared to plunge headlong into your career as a mama? All right, let's start. Want to get this over with. Everyone says so before their first time. Afterwards, it's impossible to drag them off the stage. You'll see. You'll love it. Zoltan, 